COVID-19 has caused a lot of stress and even fights among strangers over not following CDC guidelines. So why would anyone go to a COVID-19 party or go out in a crowd? As part of our effort to help the community rebound from this pandemic, we took that question to a licensed therapist. The latest on the pandemic. Last month's headlines read 30 year old man dies after attending COVID party thinking virus was a hoax. They are being very egocentric. They're not thinking about how their actions could affect other people. Licensed therapist Jamie Bronstein believes young people go to COVID parties to be exposed because they either fall into peer pressure or they truly believe the virus doesn't exist. They also don't have a very strong impulse control. So. And that's because their prefrontal cortex is not fully developed and it's not fully developed until they're 25 years old. And that's responsible for making the right and wrong decision. Bronstein says many attending these parties are young single men going through the young male syndrome. They just love engaging in high risk behaviors such as high speed driving, doing illicit drugs, doing the Tide Pod challenge, the cinnamon challenge, and in this case going to COVID parties. And we've seen young people lining up outside local establishments without masks and not social distancing. So how do parents get your kids to realize they're not invincible? First, sit down with your kids and have a discussion about decision making and consequences. And you want to be able to talk with your children, not to them. You want them to feel seen and heard, and you really want to listen to them. And if you have adult friends not following CDC guidelines, this social worker case, recommends go into the conversation that, uh, without uh, any uh, judgment. You don't want the other person to feel defensive. And basically just go in with compassion. You ca I care about you. I don't want anything bad to happen to you. Here's your rebound rundown. Bronstein gives advice on how to better handle the stress of this pandemic on her website. Head over to the relationshipexpert.com. She also has a blog and a radio show where she gives advice on other mental health issues. Just go to abcactionnews.com slash rebound for the links.